Okay. I have Valen with me, and she's in first grade. And I have Jazzy with me, and she's four. She's in preschool. So we have modified our lesson uh, to suit the age. Um, we are going to work on polygons, and today's activity, we are going to create... Hold on. She's waving at me. We are going to create polygons with Q-tips and glue. Um, I have... Valen has this one that she's picked. So... And Jazzy has this one that she's picked. Okay. So we are talking about how many sides... Um, the polygon has, that's fine, just we'll, we'll do that in just a second. So for Valance, this is what Valen has picked. So Valen, how many sides does your polygon have? Five. Yes, okay. So what I want you to do is I want you to, how many Q-tips should you take for this polygon? Five. Go ahead and take. Okay, so let me see your polygon, yours Jazzy. Okay, and this is Jazzy's. So how many sides does yours have, Jazz? Then you're going to focus on yours. Okay, so how many Q-tips should you take? Okay, go ahead. Then you can go ahead and get started and build yours. Perfect. Okay, so. I don't know how to make it. Yeah, I'm going to help you. Do you see how Valen's building hers? Yes. She's using her Q-tips to build on the paper. So look at your shape. Before we do glue, let's build it. Okay? So what do you think you should do to build this shape, this polygon? So I will do this one here, and this one here. Okay, so does that look like your... Let's see if I can show you. Okay, what do you think you should do differently to make it look the same as your picture? I can do it. Okay, well, let's look. So, does any of this look the same as yours? No. What about this part? Do you think that this part looks kind of the same? No. Look, we have one. Don, I want you to focus on yours. You have one, two, three. So you have one, just like that. Yes, yes, perfect. You connect them together. Perfect. So, do you see what the difference was? This, what do you see different between that and the way you had it like that? It doesn't next together. It's not next together. It's not closed together as one. Yeah. Okay, glue time? Yes, go ahead. You can glue yours to create that. Triangle. So your triangle has three sides. It's a coffee. Why is it it, it has an echo, so hopefully we'll watch the video when we're done and we'll see if it echoes. Okay, go ahead, babe. You can focus on yours. Your part. <laughs> right. So Valen has a pentagon that she has created with hers, and Valen, uh, Jazzy has created her triangle. Uh oh, the baby hit the computer. <laughs> uh oh. Okay, here we go. Mommy, help me. Okay, so what do you think you should do differently with that? Done. Perfect. So, what was what was wrong with that triangle? I didn't put the glue on there. Well, you put the glue on there, but it was open, and it is not a polygon if it's open. It has to be closed. It closed. <laughs> yes, that was the baby. <laughs> okay. All right. So, Valen, how many sides does yours have? Five. Perfect. And are they all closed? Um, well, it doesn't have to be perfect, but pretty much, yeah. Does it have any, um, is it round like a circle? No. No, it's not, because it, would it be a polygon if it was round like a circle? No. Okay. Let's move on to 